I'm gonna need to ask you guys one thing. You need to make sure you're not a fugitive of the law if you want to enter tonight's movie review. But it's not you guys, it's Liam Neeson. Why though? Find out, right now. Yo, what the heck? If you're a movie nerd, then you're in luck. Because you're watching Screen Collider. Like, right now. Yo, what's cracking, movie nerds? Welcome back to another video. So today I'm gonna be reviewing Taken Three for you guys. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have already seen Taken One and Taken Two. So I don't really need to jump into those ones. Like, those ones are old school. I'm sure you guys have seen these ones. But this is the newer one. And I hear it's really good. So we're going to review Taken 3 today. And yeah. Sorry, that's actually the previews playing in the background. And sorry, it's I'm watching it on a high-definition TV right now. So, um, yeah. So I'm going to review it for you guys. And let you guys know if you guys should watch it or not. For those of you who haven't seen it yet. But have seen 1 and 2. So, yeah. Let's get right into it. Peace out. Alright guys, so I'm back with the review of the movie Taken 3, and let's get right into it. So, guys, that movie is amazing. It's basically one of those movies where it's like, you know, cops hunting a bad guy, but the guy they're hunting isn't the real guy, so he has to clear his name and basically get on with his life. So, in this one, if you guys see the other two Taken, then you know that in the first one his daughter was taken, second one, they came for him. the guys who hit him kidnapped his daughter, we're coming for him, and then in the third one, third one, he's being blamed for, at the beginning, for his wife's murder. So basically, the entire movie, he's on the run, and he has to clear his name and figure out the whole story behind it. Pretty simple storyline. It was a really good movie, I really liked it, and I gotta say the special effects in it were amazing. Like, it's 10 out of 10. You know, I gotta say, Liam Neeson keeps getting older and older and older and older and older and older over the years, but he just never changes the way he does his movies. You know, like, he never changes the way he does his movies. I swear to God, Liam Neeson could be 90 years old, and I swear still doing movies where the action literally explodes off the screen. Like, I'm not even joking. That's how good Liam Neeson is. So yeah, 10 out of 10 review, highly recommended, it's amazing, and yeah, I think you guys will really enjoy this movie, so definitely check out Taken 3 with uh, Liam Neeson, and yeah, awesome movie, so that's gonna do it for the video today guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. I know I said I was gonna do The Foreigner last night, and then I got busy, so... Yeah, so I'll have those two up probably this weekend. I'll probably do those two this weekend. And then I gotta finish Saw, do Old Boy. That's another one I'll have up to date in a few days. And yeah, that's gonna be it. So I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.